Grand Castle in Transylvania. The real Dracula, a 15th century Romanian prince known as Vlad the Impaler, once lived here. Bram Stoker, author of the fictional Dracula, simply borrowed his name and homeland. As a result, Transylvania has earned its place on the map of horror destinations. On Thursday, aficionados arrived for a Dracula conference. Memorabilia was on offer to the visitors, who included writers, actors and Dracula fans. The conference was organized by the Dracula Society, which has members throughout the world. It's all about keeping the legend alive, and it's done with the help of actors who've had roles in countless horror movies. Countess Dracula, a film about Elizabeth Bathory, who was the greatest serial killer of all time. She killed 650 women, and I played her in a film. So I've been invited to give a, a dissertation about her. For local people, Dracula, with its commercial spin-offs, helps relieve the hardships of a relatively new market economy. By holding the conference here, the Dracula Society hopes to boost Romania as a tourist destination. It's ironic, perhaps, that five centuries on, local people are living off the legend. For Vlad was an unlikely hero, better known for his brutal punishments. <laughs> 